When most people think about May, they think about Mother's Day. But a lot of people don't realize that May is the opening of Pacific fishing season. And what do we do for Pacific fishing season? Well, we get halibut in the restaurant. So I'm gonna show you a recipe that's gonna take halibut and prosciutto, the traditional Italian ham, and we're going to wrap it. So let's watch this episode and see. Think food, think great food. You're cooking with burning. Enjoy making these recipes at home and don't be afraid to experiment on your own. Add other spices or ingredients if you like and if it works out and you enjoy it, send it to me at my email address, vernon at vernonscafe.com. Okay, hi, welcome to another episode of Cooking with Vernon. Hopefully you like my jacket. Um, today we're gonna do prosciutto wrapped halibut, okay? What we're gonna need here, you're gonna need some halibut, you need some thin sliced prosciutto, and some seasonings with salt and pepper and a little bit of olive oil we're gonna saute in. We're gonna do this a real quick dish. I'm gonna make it real fast for you and I'm gonna show you how easy it's done. Put a little salt and pepper on the fish. I like to put a little bit of olive oil on there also for browning purposes. We're gonna take the prosciutto and we're gonna wrap it up. We're gonna dredge in a little bit of olive oil over there still. Now a little bit of olive oil in a pan. Make sure you get the, you wanna get it nice and hot. You want it to almost start smoking because you wanna sear this up a little bit. I already had the pan hot, so it should be pretty good. We're going to put the fish in there and we're going to sear it off a little bit. We're going to do it a couple minutes on each side. We're going to brown it up real nice and then we're going to put it on a plate for presentation. We'll show you how it's done. This is very simple to make, very simple to prepare. You can do it for two, for four, for six. If you do it for more than four, I wouldn't crowd the pan too much unless you have a big skillet. But you can do it in a couple of different batches. If you have a party for eight, do four at a time. But drain your pan, clean your pan off, and then redo it with wood fresh olive oil in when you do it. Notice how the prosciutto caramelizes a little bit, it browns up. The fish browns up also with it. Now you can almost do this with any fish. You can do this with, with sea bass, you can do it with halibut, you can do it with a thinner fish if you like. If you do it with a thinner fish, it's gonna cook that much faster. Always move it around a little bit so it doesn't stick. Now while that's sauteing a little bit more, we're gonna take a little bit of fresh rosemary. I'm gonna put it right on the flame a little bit and char it up a little bit. So it smokes a little bit like that. We'll flip the fish one more time for doneness. Then on a plate like that, you can serve with your favorite rice, smashed Yukons, whatever you want to serve with it. You can even do it with a little bit of pasta. Now I like to drizzle a little fresh olive oil on top. There you go. Prosciutto wrapped halibut. Hello, my name is Dennis. I'm the sommelier for Vernon's Cafe. With the prosciutto wrapped halibut, I would suggest a nice unwooded chardonnay. Now remember, if you didn't get a chance to write down all the ingredients, don't worry about it. 
You can go to our website, print them out, go to the grocery store. Visit our website, vernonscafe.com. Mm-hmm.